Tutorial six: Creative work. Although creative work is less easily automated, artists are still advised to keep up with AI technologies. So, what can AI do currently? AI can do sound processing as well as image processing. So, after the first daguerreotype, meaning the first commercial camera was invented. Traditional portrait painting was challenged. Western paintings were radically transformed. Ultimately, this leads to new genres such as impressionism, expressionism, surrealism, and cubism. So this is not the first time that art is challenged by technology. Musicians, artists, painters may need to explore the new directions with AI. Media is developing an app called Gauguin, which is named after the French painter Gauguin, which can turn amateur paintings like the picture on the left into photorealistic ones like the one on the right. It used a new deep learning technique called GAN, Generative Adversarial Network. We will explain this technique later. This video illustrates how to change sketches into photorealistic masterpieces. The link has already been uploaded to Moodle. Gang also allows us to do image processing to apply different themes. You can turn Monet into photo, photo into Monet, zebra into horses, horses into zebras. You can also turn summer into winter, or vice versa. Here is a video on turning a horse into zebra, and the link has already been uploaded to Moodle. So, can you tell if this person is real? Indeed, this person does not exist. This image is generated using Gang. So the moral is: seeing is no longer believing. So, what exactly is Gang? It is a new technique in deep learning. It was invented by Ian Goodfellow in 2014. So basically, there are two neural networks battling each other in arm race. That is why we call it adversarial. The generated network tries to create realistic images. Then the discriminated network tries to distinguish real images and the fake images. So the two networks improve together as they battle each other. It is also possible to compose music with deep neural network. This music is a collaboration between AI and human. So I have already uploaded the link of this music to Moodle. This is a Google Doodle celebrating JS Bach. So AI tried to harmonize a given melody in the style of Bach. So you can create music in the style of Bach in this software. This is a machine learning model. Trained by 306 Corel harmonization by Bach. Let me show you how the software work. So I randomly put some notes in the score, and not to forget to input flat, naturals, and sharps. I intentionally make it as ugly as possible. Because I hope that back harmonization will make it great. The four lines, soprano, alto, tenor, and bass were generated. Let me know if you enjoyed the music. Feel free to create your own and share it to Moodle.